Hi YouTube, it's Janella123. And Scott. <laughs> He's and gonna make up a new account here pretty soon. Yeah. Anyways, due to excellent acclaim of my top five favorite movies, I'm gonna do my top five favorite songs and my top five favorite songs. Yay! <laughs> Anyways, you have to excuse the garage. It's kinda messy. We're um I don't know why it's so messy. My dad's area. But we're in here because it's not as cold yeah. outside. It's very cold, cold outside. So Without further ado, mm -hmm. we shall start, and also I'll probably have a cigarette in the middle of this video. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, so we'll start at number five. Um, I'll do my, I'll do my top five. I mean, my number five song first. Um, I have my dog in here, by the way. She's currently trying to get in trouble. So these are songs that I love. Every time I hear them, they're excellent. Love them. They make me happy. Sometimes they make me cry, mm -hmm. depending if I'm being emo or not. But my number five song is My Maria by Brooks and Dunn. Love it. Always have. Loved it since I was like, when it first came out and I lived in Fremont. So, <laughs> love it. Scott, what's your number five song? My number five one would probably be, this goes back to when I was like 12 or 13. Me and my cousin always loved Dr. Dre featuring Eminem, Forgot About Dre. That's an amazing song. Just... I mean, Eminem had first come out, and he's still young, and Dr. Dre, you know, he still had... I mean, it's just a great song. Yeah. It's good. I like that song. Yeah. Anyways, my number four song is by the beautiful Tim McGraw, ah! and um, Stars Go Blue. I know it's a cover, but um, I love that song. It reminds me of, like, two or three years ago when uh, my mom did this big craft retreat called Giggles and Goodies, which she still does. But it just reminds me of driving on the freeway and just like rocking out to it, and it's really really fun. Definitely when I first got my license and stuff, so I played that song so loud all the time. So brings back that memory. What's your number four, Scott? My number four would probably be I found this song not that long ago, so it's kind of still new to me, but I love it. It's by Young Dro, and it's called Fresh, and uh, I recommend you download it. Do you notice? Most of my songs are country, and most of his songs are gangsta. Pretty much all of them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, lovely. All right, my number three song is by Josh Grayson, and it's called Brass Bed. Um, I've actually requested this song on Highway 16 on XM, and it's played, like, once. I think the guy gets tired of me calling. He, like, kind of is a jerk. <laughs> if you're watching this, you're a jerk. <laughs> but, um, I love it because of what it... Um, about what it talks about, and it's just it's a beautiful song. I love it. Like I said, I listened to the song when I first got my license, drove around town, loved it, loved it. Mm -hmm. What's yours? My number three would be from Spider Loke, and it's called Every Day Getting Bread. And not many people know about Spider Loke, but he's actually on G Unit. I don't know how long he's been on there, but it's also another song that I just kind of found out about. And it's not very long, it's only like, like minutes long, oh. but I love it. <laughs> spider Loke. Spider Loke. I don't like spiders. I'm Compton. I hate spiders. <laughs> um, my second song is um, by Moby, and it's called Porcelain. If any of you guys have seen the movie The Beach, um, it's when they first go to the beach, and they're running down, and everyone's doing cartwheels, and they play that song. Definitely reminds me of Mexico, Cancun, The Beach. It's a beautiful song. A lot of people don't know about the song. But definitely, that's like the one song a lot of people don't know about. That I found out about it. She showed me the song. Yeah. Isn't it pretty? It's pretty good. I love I like it. it. Love it. Love it. it. What's your number two? My number two is from Tech 9 and it's called Victory. It's actually the first Tech 9 song I ever heard, and Tech 9 is actually my favorite rapper of all time. He is. So it's the first one I ever heard from him, and ever since then, I've just loved that song. Yeah, I like Tech 9 too. I mean, I don't listen to it by myself, but like, if I'm with Scotty, I'll listen to it. Yeah. I don't really complain <laughs> too much. No? What's your number one? Number one! It wasn't hard. I slammed these out like within like 15 seconds. It took me a while. <laughs> yeah. I knew what my number five was because I love them. So, my number one is by Journey, and it's Lights, When the Lights Go Down in the City. Classic. When the lights go down on my titties. <laughs> or, if you're my mother, when the lights go down on my titties. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I love it because it reminds me of baseball, actually. Reminds me of um, Pac Bell yeah. um, or at and whatever. But it reminds me of being with my dad and just like, it's who doesn't love Journey? 
Who doesn't love Journey? Yeah. Everyone loves Journey. Yeah, just everybody does. Might be yeah. summer. I think happy. All these songs are very, very summery songs. So, yeah. um, definitely what I listen to. And yeah, easy listening. Easy, easy listening. <laughs> 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 but okay, so drum roll, please. And my number one is from Tupac. Tupac. Called Life Goes On. He loves that song. I actually want to play to my funeral. Yes. So anybody future reference, <laughs> hopefully I don't, but if I die soon, <laughs> I want that song played in my funeral. I recommend everybody downloads that song. It's actually really nice. I've listened to it before, and um, I just don't like what he says. That song can make me cry, and I'm not, I don't cry very easily, and that song definitely can. Yeah, it's really nice. It's very pretty. So definitely if you guys want to make a video response to this with your top five favorite songs, do it! So do it! Do it. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely try it, and um, yeah, we'd love to see what you guys got, and maybe we're compatible on a couple songs, like two. Yeah. Yes, yeah. Uh, <laughs> but um, yeah, I mean, there's a couple of runner-ups online, like uh, Johnny and June. Mm. It's a song called Johnny and June mm. by Heidi Newfield. Brand new. Love it. I love what she says. I love Johnny Cash. Well, I like Joaquin Phoenix as Johnny Cash. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, definitely. He's a hottie with a body, and I love his Look little at that hair lip. I, I, you know, I kind of like the hair lips. <laughs> yeah. I don't really like hair lips that much, but yeah. yeah. I don't know. Who knows? Yeah. What's your one runner up? Can you think of one? Ooh, put me on the spot. <laughs> um, it'd probably be either a Tech Nine or a Tupac song. I yeah. Mean, just select, just take an album and pick one. It's probably one of them. Mm. <laughs> Alright, you got No, one. Duh, no okay. more pain from Tupac. How about that? There we go. There Get a go. name on that song. Get a name. Anyways, so definitely make a video response, comment, subscribe. I'm not going to really hound you guys because I hate when people do that in the videos. So, yeah. subscribe! Subscribe! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we shall see you guys later and definitely make a response or do something. I'd like to hear them. So, yeah. watch out for more videos coming soon from me and Scotty. Look out. Watch out, come to your city. <laughs> or titty if you're my mom. <laughs> Alright, see you guys later.